Hello, I wanted to welcome you all back to some more Dying Light. Um, this is my second walk. <laughs> Ball, they're still smoking. Tyrese, baby. But yeah, um, so I was just like wondering, like, like in the last video, I asked y'all like a question, like if the world was actually like, really nice tested with like a zombie population or quarantine or whatever, like, what would be the best place like would possibly for y'all to hire? Like, for me. All right, taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Well, let me think. Raheem, you are just smart enough to be dangerous, you know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, I never please. said that. You can't tell a convincing lie to save your life. You know what I'm doing? Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. No explosives, Rahim. So... So, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? First, go change your clothes. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Something wrong with what I'm wearing? You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Call me when you've changed. Oh. <laughs> Get some new threads, huh? I see how it is. What? It really nice <laughs> you don't like this fubu I got on? American Eagle? I don't know. But um, yeah, I was saying was like that if it came down to me like well, I kind of work at Walmart right now, and much as I hate the place, I think it would be possibly, like, the best possible place to, like, stay shut up in, I should say. But basically, cause, like, Walmart got everything. <laughs> Bad employees, but got some good-ass items. Uh, this is your player stash. You can change clothes here as well as leave any items of storage. Survival rank increase. Okay. Ah! <laughs> My boy got the yellow suit on. Knee pads. <laughs> Fresh cut. Where? I wonder if there's like a yellow polo shirt. I'm just. <laughs> I'm just one. I'm ready. Where do I find Brecken? Not so fast, dirty one. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. So get your ass up to the gym. Gym? What are you talking about? It's on the top floor. Just a couple flights up. Does loose skills pay the bills? I'm wondering. But yeah, like I would just shut myself up in Walmart. <laughs> I'd be like, fuck my managers. Because knowing them, they'll probably be like, ah, oh, there's a zombie invasion out there. Hurry up and get all the employees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But no, I wouldn't. Never. Do I go this way? No. Hell, I'm going. Uh, look at this. Look, j just look at this poster. <laughs> I mean, kicking it. Look, look, look. Just look. Do you know karate? Cause your body is kicking. Get it? Ah, uh, you don't get it. All right, never mind. But um, yeah. Yes, bedroom. <laughs> bedroom boom, baby. Honestly, we gotta keep on going upstairs. The upper room. <laughs> Eddie Murphy, life. The upper room. Raheem, I don't see you. Where are you? Well, what are you waiting for? 
See, like, I knew in some of the gameplay that I had seen that, and that shit pretty interesting. You get to climb everything. Basically, like, free running. Boom. Yeah, as you can see, it kind of got like that, that freaking mirror edge type feel, you know? <laughs> Just throw, walk, walk that line. Yeah. Graffiti! Welcome to our gym. First things first, you've got to learn how to run. What do you mean, learn how to run? Just do what I say, alright? Now, jump down to the very bottom. Oh, God. Are you nuts? I'd kill myself. Don't be a wimp. Come on, you can't be serious. Watch this. My man knows some bullshit when he sees it. Look at them shoes. Look. Look. Hey. Hey, look. Kick. Kick. Push. Kick. All right, never mind. Huh. Holy shit. Holy shit. It's a rush, isn't it? But don't blow your load just yet. There's more. To survive outside, you got to take advantage of the terrain. Most eaters suck at climbing, so the harder the terrain is, the better for you. I've got some typical situations set up for you. Let's see how you handle them. Okay, so... Sometimes it's better to crawl through the low, narrow passages. Uh, eaters will have a tough time following you. Alright. Jump. I'm a noob, huh? Alright. Oh, God. Let me just ask y'all this. Do y'all think y'all will possibly be able to do all this? Like, right. seriously? And don't fall, because there's sure as hell eating on them. Alright. And leap! Uh. Jump like that. Jump down. Man's got skills. That's my favorite. Cat grab and muscle up. You won't survive outside for ten minutes if you can't do that. Alright. Oh god. I mean just looking at these graphics is just crazy. Right. Can I make that? Oh. Alright, well I ain't gonna die, so let's get it. Oh. Well damn. Oh, this way, all right. <laughs> Good job. Okay, time for the real test. Get back to the crate. Make use of anything and everything while you run. All right. Ah, <laughs> I fucked up. Epic fail. No. Let's see. Slide. Slide to the left. Hey, check out that shimmy. Can I get up there? Uh, 
gonna get right here. Sandbags. Can't walk. Uh, uh. Almost died, didn't make it. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's enough. You've had some serious natural talent, man. I, yeah. Either that, or you've done this before. You've done this before? Hardly. The closest I ever came to this was running track in high school. Huh. Well, then you're a fucking prodigy. Never seen anything like it. I uh, can't have my time. I know I at least finished there in like a full flat. Come on now. Just saying. <laughs> All right. Ladder. So for all you that already have this game, I just want to know, like, if you can rate this game, like, personally, like, what would you rate it as? Like, how do you think Techland did on this? I'm still kind of mad off that joke that kid just said. What's happening to me? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Talk to me. What's going oh, on? Shoot. Oh, shoot. Something went wrong. Raheem, what just happened to me? Oh, shit. I bet you're having your first seizure. Just get back over here. the fuck was that? <laughs> My man had a momentary relapse. See kids, that's why you don't do drugs. I'm telling you. Make you do some crazy stuff like walk across a crane on two damn buildings. Let's see what's here. Kids jump down here. Alright, let's go around this way. I mean, just look at this. Just... J just take for a moment, just, just look at that, like all this. Like even for some gaming companies who like, well like probably make some games that like most of us don't disagree on, you gotta give them that credit. Cause like, making video games are hard. Like, it's, I mean just the due date, the development, the graphics, like all that, like, you just gotta give them that credit. Jump down here. Oh God! Hey, do that. Raheem, what the fuck was that? Does this mean I'm I'm turning? Most likely no. At least not yet. Caesars reminds you that you're infected. You better go see Doctor Zero though. He'll check you out. Probably give you a shot of antison. Before you head out to see Zero, talk to the quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off. Quartermaster. I didn't know it was on a ship. But yeah, like, I I just wanna know, like, all you free runners out there are like, I just need to know one thing. Like, how do you do it? Like, like just how do you stay like dead fit? I bet most of y'all got like the body of like an intense fitness gym trainer. And, uh, oh, elevator. No, I go downstairs. Okay. Okay, I go down this way. <laughs> going down, 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 going down. No, let's see. <laughs> I know my saying is horrible. <laughs> just, just, just bear with me now. <laughs> Take your time. Given me an actual job, and nobody suspects I'm not who I say I am. So far, so good. And once Dr. Zara helps me manage these symptoms I'm dealing with, I'll be even better.
Avenue scout. Rahim radioed me about you. Yeah, that's me. Name's Crane. I'm not gonna bother learning your name till you survive a few days, but here, this is for you. By the way, word around the tower is you're just another deadbeat in line for food or antisip. By which I mean, the people here don't much like you. But don't blame them. It's easy to get paranoid when you're isolated. And since somebody's jamming communications to the outside, there's plenty of paranoia to go around. Whole damn city with nobody to call for help but ourselves. You bring me some supplies from the airdrops, though, and you'll see people change their tunes in a hurry. That shit's a game changer. Uh, thanks. I'll bear that in mind. Listen, is there anything else? I'm in a bit of a rush. Also, if you're looking to get more popular, you can try helping folks. Do a few favors, they might like you more. Might even find a woman. Keep you warm at night. <laughs> Okay, gas pipe, lock pit, med kick, metal parts. Alright, let's see. Oh, 24% damage, durability 25, 60. Pit, pit. <laughs> I'll take all of it. I'm a greedy bouncer. I just see. Alright, I think this is a good enough part right here to stop off on. And if you enjoyed the video, please comment down below on more games I could possibly play for you. And as I said, this will be like a full walkthrough of Dying Light. As always, this is Gaming Archer. Keep it straight like an arrow. And I'll see you on the next video. Holla.